Welcome to the forest. Welcome to the Philippines. Hi guys! <laughs> <laughs> Today, we're going to be giving you the official tour of the Panda Palace here in the Philippines. There's still quite a bit of work going on, but we have moved in and we want you to see it. <laughs> <laughs> and here we go. Inside we go. Welcome to Panda Palace, Philippines. <laughs> <laughs> Panda Palace, Philippines. <laughs> Spectacular. Excuse me while I take off my flipper floppers. We're in the Philippines. Okay guys, as we go inside, here is our dining area. <laughs> we have here star apple and bananas from mama. And star apples and bananas. This is really good, you have to try this. And here is our fridge. I'm not gonna show what's inside, but it's full inside. <laughs> it's full. Yes, it's we full. went shopping. Here is our automatic washing machine. Nice washer. And our cooking stove. Absolutely, yes. and of course. I'm currently cooking black beans. Just wow. like, just like all wonderful. Filipinas, they always have something yummy cooking in the kitchen. And let's open this one. All right. There we go. <laughs> and here is our mini you know, kitchen counter cup. But it's going to be spacious once we have our uh, kitchen cabinet here mm -hmm. and over here. So we have double sink here. <laughs> The double sink. My husband got more bananas. And more bananas, yeah. Coffee maker. Our drinking water. <laughs> so, like I said, uh, this is still a work in progress. Cabinets are going all underneath here, so this is just a little bit disorganized. There's going to be cabinets placed here, split air conditioner set up here, and there's going to be a cabinet over here. So, cabinets here, cabinets here, and we'll be installing cabinets underneath for extra storage space. This is the back door, of course, and I had steel doors installed. And these steel doors are like vault doors. They have multiple locks on them. Uh, until the roll-up doors get on and everything is uh, put up in the shop area out there, uh, we've got uh, all my tools stored there so they, they do not walk away. To the room first. And this is the front room. You can see it's actually pretty spacious. We've got a, quite a bit of uh, room here. I have uh, space for my workout. <laughs> <laughs> so she's going to start doing workout videos again that she used to do. So, and then of course, this is the door that leads to the shop area, and that is the front door. And of course, it's CR time. Yeah. Time to go to the bathroom. Our bathroom. <laughs> bathroom tour. <laughs> bathroom tour. Here is our vanity sink with and cabinet in it, two in one. Woo! Yeah! Hey! There's something <laughs> into it! <laughs> Sorry! And we have here this, what do you call this, love? It's called a shelf. Shelf? <laughs> <laughs> and we have here our shower heater. The modern convenience of hot water in the yeah. province. Shelves as well, corner shelves, and my husband installed all, most of these fixtures here. Yeah, so I installed these fixtures obviously, and then yeah. installed the shelf and got the little organizer up there for everything. We and also then, have here, towel, hanging rod. Yep, yeah, towel rod. I installed a towel rod back yeah. here, and then of course, we have a real modern toilet instead of just a little bowl. 
that you have to dump water in from this bucket. <laughs> so in case you guys don't know, um, you know, this bathroom is really big <laughs> for Philippine standards. Yes. Uh, you can see both of us fit in here very well. And um, the bathrooms are different in the Philippines. Uh, the entire bathroom is a wet space, which is why everything is tile literally from about uh, six feet down. So um, that way when you're spraying and doing that sort of stuff, everything uh, can be wet in here. Um, it's just kind of the way it was because of how the toilets are most in most places in the Philippines. So you don't have like a separate shower area where you step into and step out of. The entire bathroom is a shower. Okay, ready for the room tour? Ready for the room! This is where the magic happens. <laughs> <laughs> this is where the magic happens. Nice! <laughs> the magic room. Beautiful queen size bed. <laughs> Big enough for me. Yeah, and we have here our walk in closet. This was uh, a very good buy. I got that at uh, the Pure Gold shop in Rojas, and they came here and assembled it and installed it. And uh, I only paid about $80 for that. Open that up. Let's show it. Just open it up. Yeah, hang on. Oh, no. Them. Oh no, it's messy. So yeah, it's actually messy. it's actually got a hanger inside and yes. some shelves and different things like that. Yeah. It's got one lockable drawer and it's got multiple shelves and stuff. <laughs> so and it's got the cabinet down there, everything. Yeah. So yes. it's it's really nice. Yeah. So not bad for for eighty bucks and it's actually pretty sturdy. So yeah. not yeah. too bad we got at all. This made um, customized. This is a queen size bed. It had to be customized. I'm not exactly Filipino size. Yes, but it's huge. Well, it's huge to you. It fits me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It's actually, I requested for a color white and, you know, minimalist design bed. And I also got this beddings from Comfy Beddings Online. If you guys want to, you know, order beddings like this and we have here two side tables matching side tables yes. and we have here our cctv, CCTV that's our that's our nightly viewing yeah. when we get bored we'll just watch the trikes drive up and down the road outside and the eighteen thousand pound trucks yes. <laughs> and i also have here like curtains it is double Red curtains, and we have sheer curtains here, and blackout curtains. <laughs> <laughs> About the mattress, yeah, we ordered it from where we got our AC units, our fridge, our washing machine. It was difficult to find a mattress that yes. actually fit. Because when you're a Western-sized man and you're six one like me, and you need an actual real mattress, yes. it takes and a little bit of sourcing yes, in order to find here it. Here in the countryside. Mm, yeah, so that was a little bit of a task, but we finally found one. <laughs> it's where the magic happens. <laughs> Those are your words, not oh mine, my, my love. I shouldn't have said that. You shouldn't have said that. Why not? Everybody loves it. <laughs> I guarantee you right now, they are laughing hysterically about the magic happening <laughs> inside the room of the Panda Palace. That's true. <laughs> Where do you guys do your magic? Where do you, they do their magic? Outside? Of course, inside the room. I don't know where they do their magic. <laughs> don't answer that question. We don't want to know in the comments where you're doing your magic. <laughs> magic. <laughs> <laughs> and we're going to go out into the shop area that's going to be the convenience store. Yes. <laughs> and here it is. And the roll-up doors are still coming. As a matter of fact, they're going to be installed tomorrow. So uh, I will show you some photographs of that uh, installation and everything and some maybe some video I'll roll in at the end of this. Um, 
at the end of this video because uh, it, they will be installed before I get this edited. And uh, as you can see, we're right here on the main road. And with the signage and everything, um, this is a really good spot. And believe it or not, this is actually a road right here. It's just difficult to see if they're widening it. So this is still a work in progress. But we have here our sink area where I can make snacks and sell it to them. <laughs> 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 of course, we have this store. So it means like income generating you know, mm -hmm. so we have this sink that we can cook snacks and all that, or like, you know, adobo and things adobo. like that. Adobo. <laughs> She's thinking about selling hot foods and stuff yes. like that. We're definitely going to be selling coffee and different yeah. things like that. And of course, under here, we're going to be having cabinet space uh, installed under there as well. And um, I don't know, we haven't discussed, but maybe even, maybe even some small cabinets up yeah, there just for see. extra storage yeah, or just some shelving. And we also need to put shelves and, you know, for the store items. And, and then we'll be enclosing everything, of course. And so... Tomorrow, <clears throat> the roll-up is coming. Yep, the roll-up doors are coming. The big steel roll-up doors are coming tomorrow. And uh, there we go. And if you go to the short video that I've already posted, you can see the signage that I've put in. And I'll be doing a whole lot more of uh, eye-catching type of uh, signage to uh, draw people in because this is not your typical sorry, sorry store. <laughs> and so as you can see, this isn't gonna be the typical sorry, sorry type store. This is gonna be more of a convenience store. Um, with the green and white, everything really stands out. And we've got all kinds of green and white lighting that's gonna be coming that we're gonna decorate the outside of the house with. So it's really gonna be an eye catcher, not the typical type of store that you see out here in the province. Well, guys, I hope you enjoyed the grand tour of the new Panda Palace. We've got a lot more of this going on. we got walls that are going up around this place, and it's going to look like Fort Victoria by the time it's done. But uh, you'll see a lot of that kind of stuff. We'll be showing you a lot of it, and hopefully you can actually hear us over the wind. I'm going to back out of the wind here just a little bit, and we will see you on the next Bad Panda videos. You're coming back. You know you are. <laughs>